Okay, so I've uh, dropped off Mary and I'm in the township of Mamalodi. Um, in just outside Pretoria in South Africa. So uh, this is we turn left the majority of of um, our fellow citizens live in the conditions they live in. Uh, this is what's called a township. See all the public transport, white taxis, um, like all Toyota Quantums or Toyota Sestakiles, we even get Nissan, we even get Nissan Ipendule, there's something like that they call them, but that is the that is the public transport for um, the majority of people in South Africa. Um, I don't want to be political, but uh, nothing really has changed since 1994. Uh, in fact, I'm going to be even more contro controversial by saying I believe things have become worse. Uh, I was sitting chatting to Mary, driving back and um, driving here, and we're sitting in the traffic, it's only 18 k's, but it is uh, absolutely horrendous, the roads, as you can see, probably will see on the roads, uh, the roads are absolutely shocking, uh, they are busy with the main road, they have been from before lockdown. I remember the last time I came to drop her off, uh, they were already busy. In 500 uh, meters, turn I left onto M10. I drop her off a lot uh, two, two years ago, two and a half years ago, but uh, you, know, you can see on the side the Water from the rains and holes in the road, and it is just uh, it is just shocking. It is, um, I, I I feel ashamed uh, to live in a country where my fellow citizens. situation is just that uh, you know um, because my quantum panel van Continue looks on like a taxi M10. I you end up driving <laughs> and people look at you very funny because um, you know, your car looks a lot like uh, most of the taxis here but anyway, that's uh, life uh, in a township in South Africa, as you can see in front of me, all the mini, mini cabs, mini taxis, um, IAs, Sesvakiles, Quantums, um, so that's the sort of life these people live, unfortunately, it's sad. 
Uh, have a good afternoon, have a good weekend, and uh, we'll speak soon again. Bye-bye.